Hello, everyone. I wanted to welcome you to our HCOM 200 Critical Thinking and Ethics class. Uh, here is a brief overview of our site and what we'll be doing this semester. And we can talk more when we meet in, in person in class. Uh, so if you go to Canvas, this is where most of our material will be this semester. So please make sure to check this every time uh, we have a, a class, every time you have an asynchronous or an in-person class. And also check your email daily because I will be sending messages um, from Canvas to your email. If you go to our homepage, this is kind of our landing site, our landing page. Uh, it has our general information, uh, describes our class, where we will be meeting, and there are some useful buttons here, right? So uh, I'll show you in a second, but we will organize our class by weekly modules. There's also a link to our syllabus, our assignments, guidelines for the assignments, any announcements. If there's an emergency and we need to take the class fully online, Zoom, our discussion boards, the Google Doc, where we will be sharing our brainstorms and um, other kind of thoughts and information and record discussions. And then for my Zoom office hours. Um, there's also some useful links here. Uh, again, it discusses our weekly modules. And then some information as to like how to navigate the class, how to view your grade, how to submit assignments. Here is my information. All right, so if you would like to meet with me in person, these are my in-person office hours. And I'm in the College of Arts, Humanities, and Social Sciences building. And I also have um, appointments available through Zoom. Other general information, and then information on fake news, which we will talk about this semester. Uh, additionally, you can find uh, important navigational links to the left uh, of your page. Yours may look slightly different from mine, um, but if we go to our modules, here you can find a link to our syllabus, uh, guidelines for journals and other assignments. And then each week uh, you should read the description for the week. It will tell you what is uh, going to happen in our asynchronous class that you will complete independently. Here's the work to do. And then for our in-person class, uh, what to do in class. If there's anything to do before class, it will say before class. And then there are links to journals um, and other assignments as well. Uh, if you have any questions as we go along, please feel free to reach out to me. I'm always here to help you. I know this is going to be a challenging um, transition back, but I'm excited to be here with you and I know we will get through this together. So I will see you all soon.